2016, you know, Jason Hallbauer's mission is to make life easier for the rest of us. That's the whole idea behind Easy Does It. And today, for so much more than sandwiches, the great Ziploc bag. Yes, tons of uses. Okay. 10, we're gonna be showcasing. 10 so let's uses, get, let's, let's get right, right to, to it. it. Yeah. So I'm gonna get you started. Okay. Okay, you got bag, two cups of ice. Yeah. Got six tablespoons of salt here. Okay. And so we're gonna pour juice. that in there. And, and there's just juice in there. Okay. Yeah. Just And then you wanna seal it up. Okay. Seal it up nice and tight. Grab the gloves, so it's gonna come. And you're gonna shake that the whole time I'm here. Just okay. Just shake it, shake I it. I can do it without gloves. I like so. the feel of the ice on my hands. Give it time. A couple yeah. minutes. <laughs> okay, you're my hands will be frozen. frozen. Okay, so okay, I'll keep so going on this. Yeah. Sure. So um, you're packing stuff up, you're getting ready for a move, you got your valuables. Um, what you do, put it in a plastic bag, just stick your mouth on it, physically blow it up. Then you got a bit of cushion so you don't get oh, damaged. Okay. And if you want, you can grab another one. Just to put poor that. Poor man's bubble wrap. Poor, poor man's bubble wrap, exactly. I like it. Yeah. Another one, having a bath. This is a bit of a cheap one, but just use it as a little pillow or here. Or on an airplane? Because those things are, yeah. Because those things are like 20 bucks, right? Oh my gosh, right? travel pillows. I love that. What a great idea. There you go. So, um, you're going canoeing. Yes. You, uh, you know, you don't want to have your iPhone in your pocket. It's going to, you know, don't want to get wet. Yeah. So if you put it in one of these bags, float on up. Okay. Put your stuff in here. Just pop it in there. It's gonna float. Okay, it's your dry sack. Yeah, dry okay. sack. I was gonna Save say the poor man's bucks. dry sack. This is gonna turn into the poor man's everything. Poor if man's. I keep it's, saying it's that. just the poor I won't man's. I say that. Okay. Blah. So <laughs> assume from now on. Yes. Okay. What are you doing with the garlic? It's actually soaps. Oh, those you know, are when you soaps. get all those little ends of soaps here. Yeah. And you just like, you know, you, you, what are you gonna do with that, right? You can't use it to scrub. So you do. Squeeze it together. Put it in a bit of warm water. Yeah. Leave it there. You got a bar of soap. Here, come on, yeah. what are you talking about? Is it seriously gonna meld into a bar of soap? Yeah. For real, how long do you have to leave it in there? A minute or two. Okay, yeah, love it. I'll leave that one going. So, you know, I mean, there's a lot of I issues. see why you told me to use gloves, yeah. it's freezing. It gets cold, it gets okay. cold. I did it last night, so that's I just up. thought it didn't match my pocket square, but you know. It's, it's cool, no. you're, you're looking. You're okay, about. okay, sure. So, going to work, traveling with some soup. Yeah. Dangerous territory, right? Yeah. You can go in a jar. Um, but there's always the risk it's gonna come a little bit unscrewed. You go in a bag, there's a chance it might rip, right? Yeah. So, throw them together, put a bag on the jar. Ah. So even if it comes a bit unscrewed, so that's, you know. Right, so it creates even if it comes kind of your barrier. You still have an extra, it loosens. you still have that extra, extra security here. Watch the leather. Next. Yes, yes. So, we all heard of the store Don't Pour It campaign. Yeah, don't pour it, store it don't pour it, Terrible. yeah. Uh -huh. So, um, you know, you can have these, they get a little cumbersome, you got all these, you know, jars of oil. So you just put it in a bag, dump it out, this little bag here. Yeah. You can either, uh, so you could, if you wanted to, you just toss it out like that, or you could keep it. But the beauty of this is you can compress it right down to right. little fine, so that's taking up nothing in here. Right. You got a little, you know. Put that in my pocket here. There's a lot of people out there know right now that Ziploc bags can be compressed, rolled, and hidden. Yeah, yeah, you do that with clothes, you can do it with anything. I don't know why the camera guys are all laughing. <laughs> Moving on. <laughs> uh, if you need a funnel, you yeah. have a funnel, you're trying to, you know, you got yeah. big bags of spices, just. Oh, what do you do? You cut the corner just out? Just cut the corner out, yeah. Works like a charm. So Except that's why you have cupcakes on the table. I'm putting two and two together. Yes, indeed. It's like a beautiful. Magic cupcakes. This one's a little similar to last, but yeah. just make your little, you know, precise cut here. You know what I've never thought of before until right this minute is you could also cut the corner off a Ziploc bag to put oil in your car if you don't have a funnel. Ah. Great idea. You okay. can do anything. Piping. S piping. Just squeeze it up. I'll get the back end. to work here on my. Yeah, you better. It's gonna. Look at that guy. Paul Bauer, you're gonna get a job at a cupcake shop if you're not careful. There you go. Beautifully done. And add a bit of, you wanna add a bit of cookies, but you don't wanna crumble them up. It's gonna get all over everywhere. It's gonna make a huge mess. Do what are you bag. thinking of when you do that? Anybody? She's, you know, in the, in the <laughs> oh, other room, yeah. so we can't say, no. So we take your oil crumbles, got a nice, Oreo and you cupcake. made no mess, and you huh? can store the rest. Huh? Now, finally, let's check in with my project that has given me a buy and tricep workout for the last year. This, oh my gosh, I think it's actually really worked. Yeah. yeah. So what was this, Jason? This two was spoons. orange juice. Yeah. Right. Just orange juice. That's all That's it all is. All of it. A couple orange and juice. And we now two cups of ice, six what tablespoons. Do you think? Of... It actually seemed to work. 
Mm. Delicious. Really good? Oh yeah. Nice and healthy. Yeah. Easy does it, Hallbauer. Well done, Jason Hallbauer, each and every morning making BT better, but these are our favorite performances of his. If you have an idea for Easy Does It, send us an email. We'll be back with more at 721 Wednesday morning, a very tasty Wednesday morning.